Michael Houghton crosses the line. 2-2 two -two is our score. Down low, it's Rambus against Cartwright. He's in the lane a while, dishes it off. Trivia, his dad threw the first touchdown pass in the American Football League's history. 16-6 with 6.35, quarter number one. Michael Holton on the wing to Caputo goes for the hole. Got it. He beats Sellers off the dribble. Got the layup. Not shooting it well in the early going. Cartwright is third rebound. Jordan checked nicely by Holton. Cartwright has it knocked free. No whistle. Ahead to Houghton, good pass to Pippen, layup good. Pippen tried to draw a charge, no call was forthcoming. Sometimes when it comes too easy, you have a tendency to get a little careless, and the Bulls the last couple of times down have done that, but they've been able to do almost whatever they wanted at the offensive end. 23-14 our score, Pippen to Brad Sillard. Down low, terrible pass intended for Cartwright. Michael Holton with it. Krapuka drives again. Good again. They're right back in the ball game, and they've got the crowd going for them now. Timeout, Chicago. A standing O in Charlotte. 2.39 left, first quarter. Chicago by seven. Medium range jump shot, knocking those down defensively. They were forcing the Hornets to shoot the ball over the top, running it down. Suddenly they got out of that running game and started just playing a perimeter game. Curitan keeps it alive to Trapuca. Off balance jump. Got it. Hornets' biggest lead, 37-33. Now, the little fella got right in in the basket, tried to squeeze that one out, and like a lot of the uh, inside attempts, they've all been a little short for the Hornets, but they get it back. Michael Holton checks back in as Reed departs. Trapuca hangs in the air. Got it. Nice shot. Hornets by three, 39-36, 318 left in the half. You know, the last time Jordan struggled like this was when we had him out in Los Angeles. They played the Clippers. Did not play well that night. And I hate to be the guy that has to get him the next night. He got 52 against the Denver Nuggets the following night. So someone will pay for this. Hornets on a break. Red to Trapeza. 20-second timeout, followed by Chicago. They can't... So far, they can't pull away from these guys. It's a two-point game, and the crowd is rocking and rolling. They tell me that this has happened to Charlotte a lot. They're in the game for about two and a half quarters, and then things go away for them. They're still in this one, but they're not down by eight. Well, you know, bows and arrows can't beat guns, and if you don't have enough guns, you end up losing your fight. Nice drive by Trapuca. 67-61 with 4.22 took the circumferential highway to the Hoop Tenta. Well, you are throwing some work. That Christmas does this to you? Yeah, it's amazing. 71-63. Paducah, yes. He's the guy they got to go to. He's got 21. Jordan with it, and the Bulls can tie the game. 2 left in regulation. Jordan. The old cliche, the cream rises to the top. He has 29, 14 in the quarter. Jordan jumped out and suddenly become true. It was Aaron early in the ball game. Kapuka for three. He got it. He hasn't been too bad either. He's got 29. 197. Now, if you're the Bulls, you want to put pressure on the ball handler and not allow him just to stand out there and pick out the person he wants to get the ball to. Kempton. Seven on the shot clock. Kempton double team. Finds Reed. Two on the shot clock. Partially blocked. Hit no. Rambus again. Yes. Game. Game. Will they count it? Game. Rambus at the buzzer. It's over. The Hornets win the game at the buzzer. Listen to this crowd. Meanwhile, at the scorer's table, Wally Rooney, Doug Collins, all the officials are still on the floor. 
So let's wait just a second. The Hornets are long gone, but the Bulls and the referees are still out there. Well, Collins is going now. He's uh, no, it's over. satisfied, and this game is in the bag. The finals will be back right after this.